Noel Carter, 1980 Premiership winning captain, two-time best and fairest. You must have some wonderful memories coming back to this ground. Yes, uh, really wonderful memories. Um, even driving down today, you know, it just does kick you up a little bit and you start thinking about some of the little things that happen in derbies. And, uh, yeah, it's, sort of a, it's wonderful to be here and it's wonderful to see such a good crowd. We've got some wonderful vision of you here kicking a, a famous a point after the siren, 1983 in the derby. Can you talk me through it? Well, it was a, it was a crucial game. Unlike no other games, uh, derbies are bring out something special in you. Uh, it was a job that had to, had to be done. Um, fortunately, I got the free kick and was able to, you know, compose myself, do what needed to be done. Did you genuinely think you could make the distance? Absolutely. <laughs> And some of the guys you played alongside here with some really talented footballers. Oh, well, they'd probably make a state team all on their own. Um, I don't need to name them. They've all, they've all had plenty of accolades. Um, you just have to go through any, any book and you'll see all the players that were great. The decision to leave Richmond and come across here is still one of the best you've ever made? Yes, it was a it was a good decision. It was partly to do with Mel Brown and partly to do with Richmond had, having Dale Waitman coming through under, in the juniors, so it was time for me to move on. And will South get up today? I think so. Uh, I see the captain stepped up and Big Higgins uh, you know, started dictating the last half of that quarter. I think they've had their lull. I think it's now the time to press on. Thanks very much, Noel. Got Dale, Dale Miller and Noel Carter.